the EU celebrated trade deal with Canada has been laid bare after a pro-Brexit organization exposed Ottawa has faced a worsened situation since the UK historically voted to leave the bloc. Facts 4 EU claims Canada's trade deficit since signing its joint pact in 2016 with Brussels has worsened by 27% to around 17.5 billion euros, 16 billion pounds, while the deal will be severely hampered when the UK is finally removed from the bloc. When Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau agreed the Comprehensive Economic and Trade Agreement, CETA, the trade deficit was at 13 billion euros, 11.6 billion pounds, facts for EU say. The organization say the deal with the EU will become a whole lot less as Canada sold 43% of its goods to the UK, and that when Brexit is concluded it will not enjoy such high levels of trade. They add that Canada's deficit in services had also not improved, since CETA was approved. Negotiations surrounding CETA were originally concluded in August 2014, two years before the UK's referendum on its future within the EU. The agreement is still ongoing and removes 98% of the pre-existing tariffs between the bloc and Canada. Commenting on its findings, Facts 4 EU said, it would seem logical to try to do trade deals with the world's largest economies, and to make these the key priorities. After all, if you compare just one deal with a country like the US with a country like Canada, a US deal would be worth 10 times what the Canadian deal is worth. Unfortunately after more than 60 years of existence, the EEC, EU hasn't managed to do a trade deal with the biggest and most powerful economy in the world. It added, instead of working hard and in good faith to negotiate a new trading arrangement with the UK, the EU has placed every conceivable obstacle, and quite a few inconceivable ones, in the way of achieving a successful outcome. This started in 2016 when it refused to have any discussions with the UK, not even informal ones. In the intervening years the number of artificial obstructions it has thrown up has been legion. The UK itself is currently embroiled in ongoing talks with the EU surrounding its own future trade relationships, but stumbling blocks have routinely been found between the two sides. Rows surrounding the likes of the level playing field and the fishing industry have seen the parties appear far away from reaching any form of a deal. After the UK officially left the EU on January 31, Prime Minister Boris Johnson and his team of Brexit negotiators now have until the end of the year to reach a conclusion.